Happy 4th of July, everyone. It's been a beautiful day throughout the Sunrise side. Good amount of sunshine, high pressure in control, and temperature is very comfortable with that low humidity. It's 77 degrees in Alpena, 75 in Oscoda. A little bit cooler in Rogers City at 68 degrees, and going inland into those mid to upper 70s, 77 in Mayo. Winds overall starting to come a little bit more out of the south between 5 to 15 miles per hour. Mostly out of the south and west branch at 8, a little bit more out of the southeast at 8 in Oscoda and 13 in Alpena. But high pressure in control, bubble of no trouble. Pretty much clear skies all the way from Minnesota all the way to as far east as Pennsylvania and New York State. Most of the activity when it comes to rain and thunderstorms well towards the south from West Virginia all the way to parts of Kansas. So at least for the next 36 hours, we'll still enjoy beautiful weather throughout Northeast Michigan as this high pressure quickly makes its way towards the Atlantic Ocean, though we will begin to see an increase in that humidity and those temperatures. So we're going to go back to that mugginess before it gets a little bit unsettled, pushing in onto Thursday. So here on Thursday morning, clouds are beginning to come in from the south, and that's going to increase our cloudiness. And with that humidity already intact on Thursday, that's going to leave for a couple of thunderstorms and showers to develop throughout the day. Here comes that cold front, and this cold front will actually make its way here on Friday. But in between Thursday and Friday, make sure to have that umbrella with you because there is a chance for some of those afternoon showers and storms. Now for the remainder of your 4th of July, when it comes to those fireworks, it's going to be excellent. Temperatures are going to be in those mid 60s when it starts off and eventually maybe dipping into those upper 50s once it finally tapers off around 1 a.m. Going into your Wednesday, 51 degrees early on, but quickly warming up into those upper 70s to low 80s. So it is going to be a toastier one than what we saw on the 4th of July. For the beach and boating, tomorrow is looking to be great, but the winds will begin to pick up out of the southeast at 10 to 15 knots, and then the chance for thunderstorms are possible on Thursday, so make sure to be safe if you are going to hit the waters on Thursday. Water temperatures are at 64 degrees. Next seven days, sunshine returns for the weekend, and temperatures pretty much at average in those mid to upper 70s.